that these obstacles and difficulties that we encounter through our strong practice and determination, uh, although of course we say in a general sense that this is due to the workings of the negative and destructive force of life resisting the great challenging positive force which one's generating through the practice. Uh, it's also important to be, understand that these obstacles and difficulties arise from our karma. So in the Sado Gosha, Nichiren Daishonin said it's very difficult to distinguish between Sancho Shima and karma. Because Sancho Shima, the negative destructive force of life, uses one's karma in order to try to hinder our practice. So the thing to remember there is that whatever difficulties or obstacles one faces, we created them, didn't we? We made the causes in this lifetime or in previous lifetimes in terms of eternal life. We made the causes for these effects that appear in our lives now. In other words, uh, if we made the causes, and created those effects, we can also overcome them. In that sense, you could say, uh, one's karma, uh, and the obstacles and difficulties that arise are tailor-made for us. Perfect for me. Perfect for you. Perfect, why? Perfect to help us grow. That's the wonder of the Buddhist teaching, isn't it? Whatever obstacle or difficulty, it's perfect for you perfect to enable one to grow and become strong. And furthermore, those obstacles and difficulties will not appear until the power of your faith and practice is strong enough to lift them out of your life onto the surface and of course overcome them. This is known as the principle of the four powers. That is the power of your faith and the power of your practice activates the power of the Buddha and the power of the law. So you activate that strong power. The stronger you activate it, the more gradually you lift your karma out. But it's always in exact relationship with your power to overcome. So truly, all this is so that human beings can become strong. So this, of course, was the Buddha's enlightenment, that sufferings are an innate part of life. Why are they an innate part of life? Because only through battling with those sufferings, fighting one's way through, can a human being become strong and really valuable to life itself, to uh, achieving our true purpose, in other words, in this world. So, uh, this is why Nichiren Daishonin says constantly there's nothing to fear, or he says, why should you be surprised by it? Or he says, you know, there is nothing that you can't overcome.